113 people have died of encephalitis in North Bengal. Mamta Banerjee claims she's dealing with an acute shortage of funds to control the outbreak. Now, having said that, she does appear to have miraculously overcome her money crunch when it came to organizing a lavish award ceremony for Bengali movie stars. And the fact that all these awardees were in fact trainable MPs and MLAs was of course merely incidental, at least that is what Ms. Banerjee would have you and me believe. Well, loyalty versus talent really is the big question that we're asking at this point in time. My colleague Indrajit Kundu, who's bringing us the story from Kolkata, is in fact joining us live for more. Uh, Indra, just take us through what really is Mamta Banerjee's defense. On the one hand, she claims that the state government, in fact, does not have funds to deal with the encephalitis outbreak. And on the other hand, there is this lavish award ceremony that she's holding for TMC MPs and MLAs. Well, that is right. That is exactly what the criticism is on behalf of the opposition right. and several of the stalwarts from uh, the cultural fraternity here in West Bengal. They are questioning uh, the logic, the rationale behind uh, organizing such uh, lavish award ceremonies at the behest of the taxpayers' money to award none other than uh, you know a list of uh, Trinamool Party functionaries, MPs, and MLAs. So the point that they are trying to raise uh, is twofold. What is the criteria to award such people? Is it talent versus loyalty right. and uh, at the same time they're also questioning the priority of the government saying that at a time when there are so many people who are dying and the government is saying that it is in a severe uh, you know financial crunch what explains uh, that the government is purging Absolutely. so much on such award ceremonies thanks Indra for bringing us that story clearly misplaced priorities of the Mamta Banerjee government headlines today is going to continue to track that story very closely and of course demand answers from the West Bengal chief minister